day you knew you would never be the same. The day your DNA altered to speak the language of her name. As a scientist, I can understand the art of this speaking. I did not know the road I would walk for you. Each mile a reminder of how your scars bubbled in the heat, as if to say I was once alive. Not contrived of some need to be noticed or fixed, you see. Some things have to be etched into our skin and muscle and bone until we learn it's okay to be alone in this form. So is it biochemistry or is it just you and me? I lay my valance next to yours to see how they react. Yet when I struck you, I only bounced back. And the impact took the air from my lungs. I could feel the weight of expectation hanging from your tongue. I did not feel youth had prepared me for this longing for who I'd become. And if it was awe I was feeling, I did not know it. Never before had I been struck by something so direct. I felt as though we were the only two humans to ever inspect this territory. And my heart took inventory of every hurt to cross your path, of different ways to make you laugh. I decided then and there, this would be my craft. the moon over Alaska. It is the highest state. Only a woman's body could do her justice. And I swear to God, some days I wish it was just us. And it's not that the world falls away when I'm with you. Quite the opposite, in fact. I see the world as a runaway kid, and I got the bus routes back. So is it biochemistry, or is it just you and me? that makes my heart such a lovely, lovely centerpiece. A reminder that love, it can sustain simply by trying.